Hey, people. <laughs> I almost said, hey, sheeple. <laughs> um, I am messing with top tree arc strider. Just punch you, roll stuff. Gonna see if I can get into a little bit of that close range action retune. And uh, to go along with that, I wanted to mess around with Last Man Standing because the roll that I've got is pretty good for like melee play. The only problem is it doesn't have a, a reload perk. I think you can roll auto loading holster in this column. That would be, you can also roll opening shot. Both of those I think would be a lot better than Grave Robber. They'd be kind of my choice for what I would want, but I don't have them, so whatever. Um, yeah, so because I've got Swashbuckler, my melee kills and my kills with this weapon increase its damage. So that should be pretty solid in terms of getting a nice punchy roll shotgun chain going. And to pair that with that, we are using Thorn because people use Thorn shotgun or sniper last word in D1, right? Right, guys? Um, I don't know. The, the, yeah, I, the whim. I had a whim. I was like, oh yeah, we can do the D1 shotgun loadout. So yeah, that's what we're doing. Who do we got in the game? We got a two stack. We got... Ew. Um, and we got... Uh, this man got the Soros Catalyst and he's trying to farm it. My guy. Oh right, he's a free account. Fair enough. Interesting choice, my good fellow. Again, interesting choice, my good... F this this man's trying to hit some montage clips or something. No, he's not. That's a very, very long-range focused loadout. Huh. Huh. Okay. There are a lot of new players in this game. What's going on? This normally doesn't happen. Normally I'm against a bunch of sweaty people. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Is that? No, that was that guy. Titanium. Interesting. This man has one movie of the week. It's about... That's pretty normal-ish. Okay. Oh, why, Matt? I swear, literally every single time I'm ever like, Oh, I want to do this close-range build. I get this, Matt. Like, literally every time. I swear to God. Every single time. I hate this map so much. This map... That, uh, that new Cabal map that they made. Like, Fire Firebase Hades or something. Retribution. Those are my least favorite maps in this entire game. Those three. They're all disgustingly bad. Just disgustingly, disgustingly bad. mouse is a little bit off my mouse pad. Is there a sniper here? We'll grab this. Hopefully not get sniped by anyone. Um, don't really want to play there. I want to play like inside. I gotta be careful, because I don't want to get sniped from behind. I just heard a malfeasance explosion. Oh! Oh my god! My life flashed before my eyes. Oh my lord. I got you, buddy! Is that an enemy or my teammate? 
Okay, heavy's up at B. I don't really want to push uh, straight through the long lane. Gonna do this. Oh god, sniper. I can hit this guy from here. They have heavy. I'm gonna just go inside right now. Somebody's fighting here. We're gonna run now, we're burning. Ah, oh, unfortunate. I, wait, did my health regen not start? In that amount of time, I should have healed up to about 50%. Like, 50% of my shields, because I had my shields down. So I should have been at about 150 health, so his melee shouldn't have one-banged me. He should have had to hit me twice. Honestly, I should have popped super there to survive, though. Give me that. That don't belong to you. Okay, Dawn Blade. Orbs. This guy's baiting perfectly. Oof, 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 oof. Our team is finally doing that. We can slide over here. We can fight like this kind of angle. We just don't want to fight the angle like into their spawn so much because we can get sniped from there. And we don't want to get sniped, obviously. Nobody wants to get sniped, do they? Yeah, my CQC play is just... I don't know. I, pr I should have just primed with a nade there. That's what I should have done. Just prime with a nade. Shoddy one, melee the other. You should be able to get him. Nice. Okay, there's the Dawn Blade. We'll watch for it to fly out. Or they can just kill it right there. Are we pushing into enemy spawn? Yes? No? Maybe? We don't know. Are we repeating the question? Mm, he probably shouldn't have wasted his nade. I'll take this if you don't want it. No, I can't. I can't push this. It's too many. We can fight this for a second really quickly. Now we duck back over here because we don't want people to push us from here. Now we can jump in here. We can't fight the long angle. We can fight like that. But overall, we don't really want to fight this so much. So we'll back up. We want to fight this though. There's the... what? What metal did I get? Why did it go BOOM! DOOM! Yeah, why did it make the DOOM noise? That's like the, oh, you got a Wii Ran or something noise. Yeah, it's kind of funny. I think that was the first time in the match that I've actually gotten a, uh, a Thorn Orb. Oh, Christ. That's why we generally don't want to fight this angle. 
Because it's an angle with lots of snipers and scary stuff. I want the power. I don't want to get sniped. If I see even a flash of red, I'm dodging. Ducking. No, I'm living, boys. No! Got him. Got him, baby. Got him. Ladies and gentle- oh, I'll stop. <laughs> oh. Alright. I mean, that build's okay. Thorn's not bad at all. It's a 150. It's got burn on top of being 150. It's a solid gun. Um, and Last Man Standing is a really, really good shotgun. And, uh, like, Arc Strider is just decent. Um, I feel like, at the moment, I, I think Arc Strider has um, a lot of potential, it's especially in the top tree, if you're using Liar's Handshake. I think that's probably a fantastic, fantastic pairing. Um, not that I have a Liar's Handshake yet, but... Overall, I feel like, at least for me, Spectral offers a lot more just because of Flawless Execution. That's uh, a big deal. And then Spectral Blades, not because of anything that the Super does particularly, just because it lasts longer than Arc Strider does. I feel like I'm honestly better at using Arc Strider and like moving around with it, outplaying people with it, that kind of stuff. It's just the Super doesn't last as long. And I was forgetting to throw on my Ride and Flux. But even with Ride and Flux, it still like doesn't last as long as the Spectral Blades, I don't think. Then Gunslinger, my issue with um, with Goldie is just, I, I'm not good at knowing when to pop it. Like, that's uh, a big weakness in my play. Anyway, yeah. Hope you enjoyed. I'll catch you next time.